Good evening, YouTubers. New Time Travel High Me 88 here. I'm back with a another video. And tonight it's time for another Star Trek book review, which I'm going to review tonight. Star Trek Strangers from the Sky. Ah, yes, this is a one of another classic Star Trek book that I came across again. And Oh, yes, this is an epic novel of first contact between man and a Vulcan. But look at the nice artwork design. Here we got Mr. Spock gives Captain Kirk in a pilot uniform. And there, I forgot who this woman is, but it's a Vulcan woman. And up top, you got the Enterprise refit. Because this book takes place in between Star Trek The Motion Picture and Star Trek II The Wrath of Khan. Oh, yes. Here's the front. Here's the spine. And the back. This is by Margaret Wander Boano. Okay. Let's get the light here so we can see. It says, it begins with Enterprise, the nationwide bestseller that told the legendary Star Trek crew, first adventures together. Now here comes the second giant Star Trek novel, Strangers from the Sky. In the 21st century, united at last, after countless years of warfare, humanity tours the stars. But when an alien spacecraft crash lands in the South Pacific, bearing visitors from another world, the Vulcans. Earth must decide whether to extend the hands of friendship or the fist of war. While in a distant future, horrible dreams and torment, Admiral James T. Kirk dreams prompted by his reading a Strangers from the Sky, a book that historic first contact dreams of an alternate reality and what has somehow changed the course and destroyed the Federation before it begun. And when I read this book, it is, this is a very good story when humans meet first contact with Vulcans. And when my mom read about this book, this is a very good story. And also, it mentions Carol Marcus in this book, too. Mm-hmm. Says here, his, let's take a look. S historian note, and if can, let me zoom in so you can guys can see it. Strangers from the Sky encompass two different eras in the lives of Kirk and Spock. Book one begins in those memorable nebulous years between the Enterprise first encounter in V'ger in Star Trek The Motion Picture and the death, in, uh, the death of Spock in Star Trek II The Wrath of Khan. Book two focuses on young James T. Younger Captain James T. Kirk, newly in command and his first Vulcan science officer, not quite his friend, in the time just to the prior to the first season television episode where no man has gone before. This episode introduced, first introduced Gary Mitchell, Lee Kessel, and Dr. Elizabeth Denner to the readers may wish to reference. Mm-hmm. Mm. Quite fascinating. And when I, my mom thought, think about the story, this is a very good darn Star Trek book novel. And I used to have this book a long time. I mean, we used to have this book a long time ago. But unfortunately, it got lost and destroyed during moving. But finally, I came across this book once again. Oh, yes. Strangers from the Sky. Very good story. I highly recommend to any Starfleets out there or Star Trek fans out there. I give the story 
or should I say my mom gives the story 10 out of 10. All right. I really love this episode. I mean, this book too. But anyway, um, yeah, yeah, that's about it. And remember, guys, if you have any questions, um, if I miss something or I did I miss put the outcome or the plot details, just just let me know in the comments below. And sure, I'll be happy to redo it again. All right, guys. Till we meet again. New time travel, Jaime, 88 saying, live long and prosper.